Hi everybody, Emma here. Had a really good time with Cody from Cody's Craft Corner Flan Flanders, I think her last name is. Um, we had dinner and did our Tilda Heart swap, our heart pillow. It's kind of funny because she made me this cute heart. Well, I misunderstood and I, I downloaded mine off the internet because I didn't have my Tilda books yet. She made me this cute pin cushion. Of course, I made her a couch. She kind of chuckled at that, but I really like what she made me. This is cute little heart. Look at that little applique with the flowers. And it hangs. It's just really, really pretty. And to go with my little heart pillow, here are my five pins. Aren't they pretty? Thank you so, so much for these, Cody. I really appreciate them. I'm going to hang this in my room so I can remember you. We talked about getting together, Cody, um, Tracy, and then she friended Irene, who I had mentioned in a post that I had scrapbooked, and Alyssa. And so maybe the five of us can all figure out how to get a day off together and go play. That would be just amazing. Cody had mentioned that to me because I had said it would be really cool to get a play with people. Okay, um, Co Cody had made this bag. Look, I got a Tilda bag. I have a piece of Tilda paper. Yay me. Um, a lot of these little goodies came in there. So these wooden stars, which I'm working on a Christmas um, shadow box. These are going to be amazing in it. Um, she gave me some paper flowers, which I love these. I do ink them and change them up. She gave me four covered Tilda inspired buttons, which I absolutely love. A flower. Everybody knows I love flowers. I love green. She made me a green flower. <laughs> love it. Gave me some really pretty soft pink ribbon. I have to make something for my granddaughter all that because she just likes to rub soft things like I did when I was a baby. She made me this really cool little twisted flower, which I really like. And this, check this out. This is cool. I told her I'm, I'm planning a, a secret holiday tilde, which I'm not even going to talk about much until I get her done. Um, I think she'll be amazing, but I'll share her later. But she gave me this lace, and I think I'm going to be using this on her. It's just absolutely pretty, shiny, amazing piece of lace. I love this. She gave me some Prima Butterflies. Check out the green one. You know me and green. I love the brown flower too, but I just think that is so cool. I need to learn how to do this stuff. She gave me this really neat paper pad, which I can make some cards out of. I like it. Or mats. Um, it's all two-sided. Check out the sunflowers. And believe it or not, I kind of like that. It's kind of um, a different kind of pink and yellow or beige color with stripes. I love stripes. Some tulips to like. Um, I think these are mums. I like mums. And this here looks like watercolor. I really like that a lot. And this is a K and Company water pad. I'm gonna look for the 12 by 12. She also made me this cute little Tilda box. Is that adorable or what? Oh, this box. Little tiny lace on the side. And in the cute little Tilda box which just about melted my heart when I seen it is a little angel. And I told her the story. Kenny's stepmom, Ursula Graber, made me several of these over the years. She hand crochets them also. And um, I'm just in love with them. I told Ursula that's all I ever want. I want just a couple more of these for Christmas. Nothing else. I, I love these little angels and I love them on my tree. So this, this little gal have a special place because it's something that I really, really, really love and appreciate. I like angels. Um, in this box, she also put some nice little trims. So when I'm making cards or bags for people, I have something other to work with other than just cream or white, which I have a ton of cream and white. For some reason, I gravitate to that. Okay. She also gave me some of these neat tags, which I wanted to play with for a while. There's a couple of vellum, there's some white and the pink, and a couple of cream. I, I'm going to learn how to do them. I think I need to play on some vellum before I mess this one up, but I really want to learn how to do these tags. And then she gave me a, a really nice stack of napkins, some really pretty prints, and she gave me some ideas on 
how to use them on cards and stuff, is what she said. I've only decoupaged them onto things. I've never used them on a card. I love this. The orange is pretty. And then that flower. And then my colors. Oh, my, my. Look at that. If I ever had to describe my colors, there it is. That blue-green vintage Christmas gray tan cream off-white. That's my colors right there. That is my colors. Thank you, Cody, so much. Everything she gave me is amazing. And it all came in this pink bag. And she racked me a flower. Somebody else racked her, which I love these kind of flowers. I wish I had more time to make them. It's just a paper flower. It's really amazing. Love, love, love. And believe it or not, I sell those little flowers <laughs> in my Zooter shop. It's pretty cool. I, I, I noticed that flower right off. Okay, and we exchanged all this wonderful, wonderful stuff at, did you guess, Super Salads. Yes, we had an amazing dinner. We had an amazing time just visiting and having fun. So, Cody, thank you very, very, very much. I really love everything you gave me. Um, I hope you had a wonderful night. I hope you enjoyed dinner. And I can't wait to get together with some of these other ladies. I hope we can really make this come together. Thank you all for watching. Have a good night. Bye-bye.